माय डियर वॉरियर्स दिस इज कैप्टन श्रेयस हियर एंड ब्रेकिंग अनाउंसमेंट जस्ट वन आवर बिफोर आई टोल्ड यू दैट द वेबसाइट हैज बीन अपडेटेड एंड एनी मोमेंट नाउ द डेट्स विल बी अनाउंस्ड एंड इट हैज एग्जैक्टली हैपेंड लाइक दैट सो लेट्स रिवील व्हाट द डेट्स आर इट्स वेरी शॉकिंग लेट मी टेल यू सो गाइज होल्ड योर हार्ट्स डोंट गेट पैनिक्ड डोंट बिकम नर्वस लाइक आई हैव प्रोमिस यू इवन बिफोर no matter when the exam is even if it is tomorrow we will make sure that you are prepared for it so don't worry see what is the worst that can happen your first attempt will go wrong right but you always have the second attempt so let's dive in straight away to the news now if you look at the official website i told you that this section is continuously getting updated in fact this was also not there just 3 minutes before right now this has come so let me just open up now what you need to do is go to the official mains website go to about us and in about us click about j mains 2023 click j mains 2023 it's a detailed video it's not a short video let's dive in to all the details the joint entrance examination i'm reading it out for you comprises of two papers yes we know that paper 1 for engineering paper 2 for br and planning this will be conducted two times so guys it is confirmed there will be two attempts this uh for these students who are going to write the exam in the 2023 session they will be given two opportunities to improve the scores fair enough the best of the two will be considered the first attempt students will get a first hand experience they all these details are basically to tell you why you have been given two attempts so i'm just going to skip through this it's not so important this is just to make you understand why you have been given multiple attempts now here is the main detailed news j mains 2023 session 1 paper 1 bb tech will be held on 24th 25th 27th 28th 29th 30th 31 january january i will just zoom in on to this date i want you to see this very very clearly the first date first attempt dates are from 24th to 31st january 2023 followed by sessions 2 session to the next attempt when is the next attempt going to be look at this 6th 7th 8th 9th 10th 11th 12th april that means j advance will happen in may that means j advance will happen in may is that clear j advance will happen like it used to happen before what about neat neat will also happen in may bachcha don't believe all those rumors where people are seeing you know uh, something sir it is here sir it is there sir it will happen in june sir it will happen in july sir no 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 it will happen in may only just look at the way things are going it's looking very very bad it has been de decided to provide choices in first section of paper 1 of part 1 and paper 2a of 2b to cater the decision of different boards across country regarding the reduction of the syllabus however total number of questions to be attempted will be remaining the same physics 25 chemistry 25 mathematics 25 wherever applicable so this means there are some boards which had reduced syllabus because of the covid pandemic so the optional syllabus the extra syllabus questions will be there as extra questions but the common syllabus will be you know think of it like compulsory so that has to be attempted so total 25 25 25 questions just like before so it's a 300 marks paper think of it that way is that clear everyone is that clear harshit don't worry everything is not finished wait we will plan something we will plan something don't think that sir everything is doomed and if you find that sir we will not be prepared then guys we will raise the voice on behalf of all the students now if you want me to raise the voice on behalf of all the students sir we don't want the exam in january you need to put a comment after the video ends you need to share this video across many students and make sure you stay subscribed and make sure you like the video so that it reaches the masses so that the government so that the nta everybody can hear the voice of the students that listen this is too early for an announcement fine you guys spread rumors last few months and then suddenly you come and tell that hey you know what the exam is going to happen you know already that we already told in so many newspapers that the exam is going to happen in january but that was not official statements this was all rumors so guys if you feel that this is not fair please let me know in the comments all right fair enough now let's see what are the other things that are there 
in the notice because a lot of you are interested on the eligibility criteria lot of you are interested in sir what is the exact details let's look at all those details public notice just go to latest news the home page public notice not nothing in news and events in public notice inviting online application forms for the je examination 2023 session 1 candidates are requested to fill the forms very carefully all right and let's click on this so this is the main public notice okay let's open this up online application form online application form will be open from 15 december that's today from 9 pm just one hour from now barely one hour from now the application form will be open till 12th of january so 12th of january the application form will close last date is 12th january 11 50 pm cities will be announced in the second week the downloading of admit cards in the third week date of exam like i told 24th to 31st of january center date everything will be as in the admit card recorded responses will be announced later on the websites are this standard declaration of the results nothing specified this will be conducted in 13 languages including english hindi assamese bengali gujarati kannada so many other languages the first session only session one will be visible oh this is interesting only session one will be visible candidates can opt for that in the next session session two will be visible the candidates can opt for that session the application window for session two will be reopened okay so session two will happen in april basically not now it's in april no announcement regarding the registration as of now it's only for session one okay then the paper scheme timing eligibility other information are requested to please check the information bulletin available on this particular website okay you can see 20 marks sorry 20 questions for maths chemistry and physics in section a section b 10 questions each for all the subjects so totally so totally you can see there are 90 uh, in uh, i'm not sure why is it 90 over here have they done some mistake i'm not sure let's see paper one and pay pa and part one of paper to each subject will have two sections fair enough section a will be mcqs that's also fine just like before section b will contain questions whose answers are to be filled as numerical value so guys numerical value questions are also confirmed numerical value questions are also confirmed and mcq questions as before in section b candidates have to uh, have to attempt any of the five questions of the 10 questions so guys over here in section b you have to attempt only five out of all the 10 questions the remaining five you can leave it you don't have to attempt it it's a completely computer based exam morning 9 to 12 and 3 to 6 so there are two shifts just like before just like before the candidates can apply for 2023 to online mode only application has to be submitted by the candidate no candidate can be allowed to be filled the form more than once so be very careful fill the form properly don't make mistakes don't bank on the correction window last year many students filled wrong cities wrong photographs wrong names wrong date of birth please don't do all those things fill aram say it's not like if you fill before you get a better center there is nothing like that there is no guarantee candidates must ensure their email address mobile number is perfect okay in any case of any difficulties you can contact these helpline numbers so let's see if there is some other information which has come up okay let's see if there is some other information which has come up on the main web page well i don't see anything oh j means application you can see session one application has also opened up right over here i'll just click okay i'll just click okay see where is it i'll show it to you once again so just click home page you can see if you click home page right if you click home page j means 2023 session one application okay if you just click on that if you just click on that you will get this particular window just click on it it will open up this page so application form new registration so this is what you need to completely fill so you have to start with new registration if you are done with the registration you can use your application number password pin etc to sign in so this is how the registration form right now looks like this is the registration form guys okay i'm just opening it up for you so that you guys don't get nervous because when you see it for the first time now you get confused sir what is this so much information so i'm showing you everything step by step okay let's have a look at the information bulletin as of now over here 
let's see if there is something interesting that we can find uh, usually uh, you know it's uh, got to do with the patterns and all of that so let's see yes these are the dates standard things which are given over here then you can see the application fees it's anywhere between 1000 rupees to 5000 rupees 5000 is for foreigners depending on your category and your uh, sex it is different you can see for males and females all right great so application form okay how do you uh, how are you going to fill this application form all the details are mentioned but i will make a separate video later on on how exactly you are going to fill this form and what are the different details that you need to consider anyways all the details are mentioned in this including including the syllabus as well i believe oh you can see the type of questions the mode of the questions everything has been given over here syllabus will be down over here let's have a look let's have a look somewhere down yes you can see down over here yes so all these are the different details guys so it's a very big document it will take ages to actually scroll through it so what are the important things that you should consider everything i will let you know later on all the centers everything is mentioned right over here so many details are there you can see all the details are there oh i can see the syllabus is also there over here you can see this is syllabus so the entire syllabus is mentioned over here the entire syllabus is mentioned over here so we'll go through it and i will let you know if there is something missing if something additional is there generally nothing will be additional if something is cut out i will definitely let you know over here now if you look at the examination cities you can have a look at that as well you can select your country you have multiple options to give the je mains exam even if you are outside you can see you can give the exam from even uae many students write it from uae and other things so you can select that and you can select uh, the state and you can select the medium you, you will get all the centers available in that particular location so that option is also there over here view examination city okay all the fees everything is mentioned over here all the details on how to fill it is mentioned over here click to proceed click to proceed okay i don't think it is working because i think we'll have to wait this is the basic general idea of how the form is where the form is what are the different things you should be aware of just to summarize you have your home page uh, just to summarize you have your home page this is where you start uh, filling up your application or login here you have the public notice and when you click on this only you will be getting all the information bulletin everything okay all the information bulletin everything you will get it in the new registration so this is the main gist of the entire scenario now how exactly should we prepare for january attempt what should be our strategy should i prepare for boards should i prepare for uh, je uh, how do i clear je advance because if the plan works then most likely je advance will be in may neat will be in may cuet april may bits again in april may everything your em sat again in may may month so all the exams are going to be crowded in the month from april to may june uh, time period so before that you have your boards unless you are a repeater so how exactly you should plan out and what exactly you should not do what you should do in the next few months i will be making a separate video on that but what are your problems what is it that you want me to do because i know generic things but sometimes you might have very specific things so go ahead smash that comment also if you also have the same kind of query if you have similar problems you have to reply to the comments because i read the comments whatever you guys post on the uh, your videos right so first of all do not get tensed okay let me tell you that number 2 even if the exam is in january i will give you a strategy by which you will get 99 percentile even if you feel that you are getting zero marks even if you feel that you are getting sir i am getting hardly 20 30 marks in subject how many of you are there like that acha what about the criteria i couldn't see the criteria bachcha i'll have to see scan through the entire document i'll have to scan through the entire document that is a very good question let me see if i can find it is there a find option somewhere eligibility yes eligibility this is okay okay eligibility there is no age limit 
list of qualifying exams okay uh, only those candidates okay state of eligibility okay fine but they haven't specified as as for now at least i can't see it i'll have to see through it bacha one second can anybody else see it please let me know okay is anybody else see it please let me know guys eligibility anybody else can see it just let me know at least i am not able to see okay so i don't see any minimum cut off at least now okay at least i am not able to see any percentages over here okay okay i'm not sure maybe later on if i find it i will let you know but as of now i am not able to see anything okay 43 page is it okay i will have a look properly and then let you know okay so guys i can see many of you are saying that yes sir we also have that and if you feel that okay something is going wrong please let me know we will do something about it okay for now start your preparation and you know the je crash course is up and running with the lots and lots of discounts so if you are watching this video right now go to the description box you can see uh, over here there is a link for joining the crash course both languages are available english as well as hindi and you have the topmost teachers the batches are starting right on time 9th in december both the crash and crash plus you have mind blowing puzzles mind blowing quizzes uh, leaderboards you have all the interactive elements with in class doubt solving as well as assignments class notes test series rank prediction uh, part test full syllabus test study material after the class doubt solving available in both the models but if you want live sessions for uh, problem solving live sessions for pyqs and you want a personal teacher and you want the complete detailed syllabus coverage as well lectures so that is there in the crash plus you can see beautiful offers going on on this 4000 rupees for the crash course and you can see a few seats are left make sure you enroll into this before because a lot of students what happens the moment announcement happens everybody goes into the batch then uh, you will see if you are late then you will have to wait for the next entry so that will happen after again one two weeks now here one one day will also count so try to enroll into the batch as soon as possible fill the form later on fill the registration form later on but get enrolled in the batch as soon as possible you have the second option this crash plus was for 32000 rupees because we know many students are now interested we have lowered the price for your benefit so half the price is waived off you can get this for as low as 1333 rupees per month so make the best use of all the resources that are available for all of you guys okay so don't worry even if you have 20, 20 by 300 i will give you a plan i am telling you join the crash course and i will give you the plan for scoring more than 90 percentile at least in the first attempt by the second attempt you will have 99 percentile okay so that is what shreya sir the captain shreya sir is telling for all of you guys okay so stay strong stay motivated say that we can do it say that nothing is impossible say that Yes, sir. We are going to rock J Mains 2023 because Shreya, sir, the entire Vidantu team is going to be with you. Are you guys ready to rock it? No matter what happens, even if the exam is tomorrow, even if the exam is in January, even if the exam is in April, we are going to rock it. Say that loud with me, and trust me, you will feel really good about yourself. And get set, go, guys. It's the time to battle. It's the time to fight. Let's get set go guys this is captain shreyas i'll keep you guys posted on all the important strategies in the days to come have a lovely evening do not get tensed just study that's all bye bye assalamu alaikum captain shreyas signing off